Hello everyone, please welcome to another episode of Peak Plugins Product Seller and today I will show you how you can display easy digital downloads in a slider and we have added new feature to our plugin Peak Plugins Product Slider slider for easy digital download EDD downloads once you select this radio button you will see the tab query EDD downloads you can set and you can set max number of download and select the download category and tags and other options query order order by and download by IDs display downloads by IDs and select a layout for the downloads you can create a new layout or select existing layout which support to display the downloads element like we have created a EDD download for easy digital download you can customize existing layouts let's see how you can customize the layout for downloads we have name it EDD down layout so you will see the layout elements for download post title EDD price EDD add to cart EDD categories tags and we will add some other elements in future and default thumbnail and post title you can use here and content so we use here thumbnail and download title you can customize the style for the title and update or save the layout and choose this layout under item layouts option and hit the update or save your WCPS settings and let's see what is happening on the slider preview and here is the download slider come from your download products or download post type that is a music album a sample product and we can see this one more sample product here it is one more sample product and you can click to link to download here it is so you can add more elements to your layout like edd add to cart let's update the layout and refresh the slider page and you see the edd add to cart button is displaying here is the variable product add to cart and this is really exciting you can customize these elements add some other elements edd categories you can also let's see the slider page what is happening and you see the category is displaying here you can customize these elements by adding a color or add a prefix text and customize font size and margin also save the layout and refresh the slider page and you see the categories style also applied and this way you can add other elements on the layout as you need you can add new elements to layout builder by filter hook and add your custom input field to these elements by filter hook you can check our documentation how to extend these elements or customize these elements hope you love this thanks for watching